Okay, so let's, let's talk y'all a bit about, about profile writing. And I asked you to go home, you know, brainstorm, think about what you wanted to do. Hong Ye and I talked about an incredible idea. I taught uh, Thursday morning, uh, September 8th. Um, and in between classes, I like to go home and try to take like a 20, 30 minute nap because you know, I come back to campus sometimes for office hours and whatnot. And uh, I was taking my little nap, getting to bed to take a little nap. Phone rings, it's a Chicago number. I usually don't answer numbers I don't know, but I picked it up and then the person says, is this KSA Layman? I said, yeah. And then they were like, uh, where are you? And then I was like, who are you? Like, who are you? Ta what are you asking me? And they're like, we uh, just wanted to know where are you? I'm, I'm so-and-so, I'm from the MacArthur Foundation. And then I was just like, please stop playing on my phone. Like, I'm trying to take a nap. Uh, I gotta go do a reading in a little while. And they were like, here's a no, this is real. We're from the MacArthur Foundation. Um, and then they, and then the person switched me to somebody else who read a description of my work. And then they were like, do you believe it now? And then I was like, no, I don't believe it now. Like, you know, um, and then they said, okay, he say, well, you are MacArthur and here's the amount of money that you want. And when I heard that, that, that amount of money, I also thought it wasn't real because the amount of money went up from the years previous. Uh, and then by the time I got off the phone, I went from like disbelief to like, I was thinking if this was real, I need to be very thankful. So I was just like, awesome, like, thank you, thank you. Th like I was, I was, a, I was, thank you, know, I was like melting. And then I got off the phone. I mean, and I got off the phone and I fell to my knees. And then I was like, wait, if, is this real or not? And then I had to come do that, do the reading. All the ways of having him here before today have been good. But to be able to welcome him to Rice and to listen to him here now as a professor and a colleague is, of course, the best. You know, room full of people, and it's supposed to be like an introduction to, to KSA. I'm introducing myself to these, to Rice. Rice introducing themselves to me. And honestly, fam, like, I was shell shocked. At, I was shell shocked at that event. And, and, I, and I do remember people being really generous. I remember that the students were being like, like out of this world, um, brilliant and probing. I remember some other faculty, some of my colleagues were asking some great questions that I, that I still think about, but I don't remember anything I said. Cause I was just out of it fam. Like I was, in my mind, I was like, yo, like I might have just won a MacArthur or somebody might be punking me into believing I won a MacArthur. Either way, it's just a lot emotionally. I wanted to just tell everybody because it's just hard to keep that. But then you don't want to tell everybody, anybody because you think it might be a joke. You know what I mean? And I say that because a lot, you know, for what we do, the MacArthur is kind of like, I don't know. If, I mean, it, it's, it's. Uh, I, I don't want to lie. Like, you know, I haven't hoped to win one, but I've, you know, I've dreamt. But it never was a hope because it's not real. But like a dream, oh, yeah, I would love to win a MacArthur. But that is the highest dream you can have in like what we do. I always thought that I would do something interesting with my writing, but I never thought I would ever make money, any money, ever, you know, as a young writer. So like just having a book felt like an accomplishment. But MacArthur, I'm not gonna lie to you, like I don't, that's the biggest professional thing in my career by far.